The Hillsborough County Sheriff says Joanne Terrell was celebrating her 78th birthday. What he says should have been a joyful time instead filled with heartbreak. We're going to miss her. That's how friends and neighbors feel as they're left reeling from a tragedy too close to home. Ellen Henderson said she just saw Terrell on Monday. I was shocked. You know, I thought maybe she fell. But when I saw the forensic sheriff cars, I knew it was more than just her falling. According to the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office, on Tuesday, deputies went to this home on Colwood Drive to do a welfare check on Terrell. When they got there, investigators say they found Terrell dead and covered with a blanket, while they say they found her 53-year-old son, Douglas Terrell, who also lives in the home, in a locked bedroom with a gun near him. The Sheriff's Office says detectives determined Joanne Terrell had been shot and killed. They arrested and charged her son. John Mulvihill lives right next door. It wasn't until last night when we seen the police and the fire trucks and all the other things here that I came out and said, you know, what's going on? Joanne, known to people in the neighborhood as a wonderful person. Now they're trying to make sense of a senseless crime. Anytime anybody dies like that, um, you know, you, you feel bad. I mean, Joanne was a nice person. The investigation into what happened is still underway. Douglas Terrell is charged with murder in the second degree. In Hillsborough County, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.